हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू माई चैलन एलियन टैक चैम्पियन टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट हाई यू कैन क्रिएट द ए विंडोज इन ट्यून विट लॉकर पॉलिसी राइट सो मोस्ट पीपल एक्चुअली इफ यू आर न्यू टू द इन ट्यून एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन यू यू मे बी नो वट इज द बीट लॉकर पॉलिसी हाई यू कैन इनक्रिप्ट योर यू विंडोज विंडोज टेन मशीन्स राइट सो to use the intune uh, you need to uh, you to encrypt your windows 10 devices you you need to use the bit drive or microsoft native bit locker drive encryption if you are using any third party in encryption it's i mean uh, microsoft always recommend to use the bit locker which is actually native bit locker right <coughs> there are uh, some pre requirements to use the bit locker right and and some permissions uh, you need to uh, uh give to the to your support team to view the key so how you can clear the bit locker policy let's so so there are two way to clear the bit locker policy so this is the microsoft endpoint portal i will show you as soon as you land it to the home page you need to there is uh, as i mentioned there is two way right the first one you can uh, go to the endpoint security right and you click on the div screen questions and you can create this policy select just create this policy select you can see you can apply the bitlocker policy in only two ios or windows 10 it's not for android and you can select the bitlocker policy that is only profile right and what is up here so bitlocker drive encryptions is the data production that integrate the operating system right so uh, and this will actually address the threats of data theft or expose from the loss or stolen or inappropriately decommissioned computer right and you know here you can view the encryption report of all managed devices like from the devices monitor and encryption report i will show you so just create this right so you have to give the name right uh just give a name bitlocker policy or we can take windows windows bit locker in encryptions policies right click next and you see there is three settings one for the base settings so this base setting will apply for all so you want to enable the full dos disk encryptions for os and fixed drive of course yes you want to require storage card to be encrypted no hide prompt for the third party if you are using third party encryptions you want to hide the prompt i should know right and then this is fixed drive setting right uh fixed drive setting you want to configure of course select configure and then fixed drive recovery right you want where you want to uh, configure of course it should be required right you want to uh just the password or key of course the password and key you want to require the device backup to the azure active directory of course yes Reca recovery password creations it should be allowed right or it's required and all these configurations you can configure it right for similar like os drive okay start of authentication is required yes so this is the pre requirement so tpm should be present if uh, tpm 2.0 should be there right and here you want there is a you want to tpm is required right compatible tpm of course it's required you want to um, encrypt the devices with the pin i don't want to set the pin but it's it per your company requirement you can set it pin tpm startup key if you want to ask users to put the key every startup you want to key and pin both so whatever you can configure as per your uh, or uh, as per your requirement right so uh, this is the actually um, and and the prerequisite is to this one your your windows devices must be running on 18.9 uh, and later and or windows 11 your devices must be as already join or hybrid is already join your devices must contain it at least tpm trusted platform 1.2 right the bios mode must be set to native uefi only right 
so these these four requirements should be there and uh, th uh, this is the actually um, important things uh, so you can configure uh, the BitLocker policy to automatically and silently enable that means the BitLocker enable successfully without pressing the any user interface to the okay so devices must the right uh, device must uh, meet the pre-required and then you can configure the removable drive as well if you want to configure for USB drive or anything I don't want to configure select no just select yes and apply to the default and assign to all users or to the groups or just to the windows machine that is great this is very simple way uh, you can uh, apply the bitlocker policy another way you can go to the you can go to the um, devices uh, and then configurations profile in my previous video i have shown you and then create the profile and you can select the windows 10 and later select the templates right here you can select the endpoint productions you see here bitlocker endpoint production create create and then you'll see the same i'm just showing quickly bitlocker policy and click next and you see here all these windows encryptions you have to go encrypt the devices encrypt the storage card so here you will get uh, more options right what is the operating system drive encryption the removal drive all these settings are you will see some more options here as compared to the endpoint security so you need to configure the windows encryption here right and just click next right and next apply to all users select next and you can rule assign if the profile is os version like as i mentioned 18.9 right something like that you can put or uh, 10 right or os editions okay os editions let me so of course windows 10 enterprise right and then uh, okay this let me delete this create design all solutions okay and and then uh, professionals as well click next next and create right so here you will see the more options right uh, for the pit locker policy so either you can use um, the endpointed um, security sections to apply the bitlocker policy or you can use the configurations profile by going to the devices and create the bitlocker policy if you uh, want to set the more granular level but the the same policy will do the same thing on on your devices i would prefer to apply from the from the configurations profile because i am i can see more options here but it's the same policy there is no difference on the policy right I hope you have learned how you can create the Windows BitLocker policy and uh, please like and subscribe the channel. My channel is name is Alien Tech Champion uh, so that you will get the latest video and uh, interesting of topic or, or you will get learn about the Microsoft Endpoint Manager. Till then thank you have a good day bye bye.